Today I'm going to give a demonstration about how the Oki AC125A crossbar PBX can count dial pulses using the pulse counting relays. Pulse counting relays are located in the originating register and they're used kind of like flip-flops to count the dial pulses and when the number has been completely dialed uh, the A, B, C, D and E relays are at their terminal count and the C relay is released and that's what uh, accepts the digit. So here let's try to dial ex extension 66 and see how it works. And there we can see extension 66 is, re is uh, ringing. Let's go ahead and try another one. Let's try extension 60 because I have a phone hooked up to that one. Now you can hear the phone is ringing. Okay, but what if you want to support touch tone or DTMF dialing? The AC125A as equipped doesn't support DTMF dialing out of the box. However, Oki planned ahead and they have it available as an option. The option is enabled by buying the touch tone decoders that activate the PA through PE and C relays. It plugs into a 25 pair connector at the top of the Oki. And here I'm going to show you a touch tone converter that I, I built. It's kind of a kludge but it works. So let's take a look at how this operates. Now we'll go ahead and use a touch tone phone for this and we'll dial extension 60. And let's try it again. This DTMF converter is a real kludge. Um, it was kludged together using an off-the-shelf uh, touch tone to relay adapter that I found on Amazon. And it has a uh, 8051 style microcontroller on board. I was able to, um, to hack the firmware and replace it with my own firmware, which operates the uh, six relays on this board which in turn operate the corresponding PA through PE and C relays on the on the Oki. And then I used of all things a Radio Shack um, audio tap for a phone line for the phone line interface. And then this is all wired to a 66 block and then there's a um, um, 25 pair cable going to the top of the Oki. So let's let's watch it again. Again, dialing extension 66 with touchdown. There's nobody at 66, so let's try 60. And again, we can try that with uh, dial pulse as well. So this is what can be done with um, hacking and uh, it is a real kludge but it works and I plan to build another one for the second originating register. I'm going to put the code on GitHub so you can check out my GitHub page for more details if you want to build something similar. Thanks for watching.